Greetings and gains guys, AJ here, and it's another back video. I thought I would treat you guys to film in a different gym, I've actually filmed in different gyms for my last few videos, but anyway guys, I'm training here at Fitness First and start off with machine rows, 5 sets of 10 to 12 reps. I love this machine, especially when it's plate loaded, I'm a fan of plate loaded machines and I don't have them at my gym. I use one arm at a time because I, I have a slight muscle imbalance in my lats and one side is stronger than the other. I'm about that symmetrical life and if I feel that I'm weak from one side then I'll fix the issue by doing more single sided work. Especially important as my right side is weakened by my rotator cuff tear which I've been thinking was a deltoid strain for the last 6 months and it wasn't. I do the same for the machine lat pull down, I would usually use the actual lat pull down machine but I wanted to do single sided work, again 8 to 12 reps but this time I'm only doing 4 sets. Dumbbell rows, for one exercise I would never sacrifice on back day, again it's a singular sided exercise and I actually do prefer doing singular work despite the muscle imbalance issue and dumbbell rows is one of my favourite exercises on back day, it looks simple but if done right it feels awesome. I was actually training with my friend Ollie at the university gym and there's sometimes lectures or tutorials in the gym so we couldn't use all of the gym. We had the issue of having no bench because all the benches were downstairs where all the students were working and we were upstairs, there's two sections. So Ollie suggested we did dumbbell rows like this and it felt right to me. I find it a lot more comfortable and this is how I perform them now. Next up is the seated cable rows, I don't know why but this specific machine felt different to the one I use at my gym, I didn't like it, it felt a bit stiff, here you see me attempting a heavy weight, I didn't get enough reps in, I dropped the weight and I continue, I do this in every routine and exercise I do, reps are important to me, I don't invest time, effort and money into myself and do what I do for half hearted minimal results, I want my muscle to burn and grow. Another exercise I always do, you guys have probably seen me perform this in my older videos too, the reverse grip lat pull down. For some reason I am extremely strong on this in comparison to the conventional wide grip overhand lat pull down. I love the squeeze at the bottom and stretch at the top. This really hits those inner lats. I don't even know what this is but let's call it the crossover lat pull down machine. At this stage I would usually perform the t-bar rows or barbell rows but there wasn't anywhere to perform the t-bars and there were no barbells vacant. You usually have to sit facing the front but I didn't like how it felt in connection to the targeted muscle so I sat with my chest against the pad and it felt a lot better. Last but not least, I burned it off with 6 sets of straight arm pull downs, taking reps to failure, really hitting that serratus and trying to bring it out. Anyway, that's me done. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, like and share. If you haven't subbed, what are you waiting for? You want to make gains, don't you? Let's make them together. If it don't make gains, it don't make sense.